I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Sorry, guys. I was like, oh my God, I need to set an alarm for the live. I was so involved with all the new product. It is incredible. It just keeps coming. It just keeps coming. Donc, bonjour tout le monde. Je suis ici. Je sais, je suis en retard. Je savais même pas l'heure. Et euh, j'étais en train de ramasser toutes les nouveautés à vous montrer. Puis je savais pas que c'est déjà après quatre heures. Donc, je m'excuse. Je vais faire une alarme sur mon téléphone qui répète chaque journée pour que je suis être là avec toi à quatre heures. Donc, Allison. Did you just pull one of each paper? Okay, no, no, I just wasn't sure if you did. Okay, donc, hi guys, bonjour tout le monde, hi. So, we have some interesting stuff to show you today. Premièrement, hier, après vous montrer toute la Stamperia, j'ai oublié de vous montrer les papiers à l'unité. So I'm going to show you that today. I forgot to show you the individual papers. Some of them are just like, <gasps> they take your breath away. So I'm going to show you that. Um, wow came. So Pam, you're going to be happy when you come tomorrow because wow is here. Erin, uh, no, I think you can still hold on to it because, well, you kind of like a little bit of everything. So yeah, just sign it over. It's not a problem. And uh, bonjour, bonjour, Vero et Ruby et okay, and Tanya, Odette, Pam. So Pam, I just said I'm going to be showing wow, so you're going to be happy. And Diane, I don't know if you're here, not Diane, mais Diane, parce que je vais montrer le Pink Fresh aujourd'hui et je sais qu'elle attend ça. J'aimerais bien savoir... Uh, en regardant hier le Stamperia, c'était quoi ton ligne préférée? So, guys, after seeing Stamperia yesterday, which was your favorite line? Because I can pretty much tell based on the sales, but um, I'm curious who had favorite lines out of that. So, if you had a favorite line, please put it because I'm, I'm very curious. I think, I think I know which one it is, but I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. What's for you, Carla? Um, how about some new paper art? See, how does that sound? Tracy, Dominic, pour toi, c'est Lynn Perella. J'ai six, no, quatre nouveaux étampes de Lynn Perella. C'est pour toi, pour Julie, passion, yeah. Uh, Voyage Fantastic, I guess you can count that in, Fred, but that is an older line. But I am getting the 12 by 12 back in because of it. Uh, yeah, Passion is good. You know what I find, though? It was very heavy into ballet, so although it's beautiful, you still need to have a ballerina. Oui, France, les arts. But Passion, Passion, we got a lot of people loving Passion. So, Karen, I just asked what everybody's favorite line is um, from yesterday. Yeah, and the, the Voyage Fantastic was very nice. I agree, Erin. And Fred is, Fred, I didn't, you, you're not gonna want the, um, you're not gonna want the Pink Fresh. You may want some of the Wow. Um, and then uh, I did get Seth stamps back in. I am going to grab those for you. Donc, j'ai reçu, je pense, trois de chacun de les nouveaux de Seth de la, uh, le mois passé. Threads is beautiful, Karen. You're right. Uh, aussi, j'ai reçu... Donc, are they up on the wall already? Were you that quick? They're not on the wall. Okay, they're by the wall. Okay. We're going to go over here just to give you a reminder. Oh, the violin is beautiful, May. You're right. Seth is not new, Aaron. It's the same as last week's, uh, last month's, excuse moi. Okay, so Allison said Seth was here. So Seth is up here. Donc, qu'est-ce qui est venu aujourd'hui? 
C'est le numéro 19, number 19, came back today, number 20, and number 21. So if you weren't quick enough last month, they are back, okay? Very exciting. The other exciting thing is that a lot of Tracy stencils came back in. So Tracy stencils, look, Allison's going to show them to us. Donc, le numéro 211, très populaire, puis elle fait beaucoup avec des patrons. Donc, ça, c'est vraiment for her pattern play. Fabulous. 225, 225 is back in stock. Again, what you have to go look up Tracy Scott, parce que ce qu'elle fait avec ses pochoirs est incroyable. Après ça, la feuillage, donc... Numéro 226, number 226, also beautiful. If you haven't followed Tracy Scott, Erin, you should go take a look at her if you haven't. Uh, Tracy's stuff is beautiful, and what she does with these elements is incredible. And then we have number 210, 210. Moi, j'aimerais bien prendre ça avec un peu de pincer noir. Puis après ça, je pense que je vais faire la doodling en dedans. So maybe, maybe that's something I'll do with you guys. Then 209 et 208 étaient très populaires. 209, c'est tout le lettrage. 208, c'est les chiffres. So this was all letters, just miscombobulated. And then here we have all numbers. So both of those are back in stock. Then... The few, oh, Jofi. So, Jofi, number 99, numéro 99, est en stock. Moi, je trouve cela très fun. I think this one is great. And what I like here is the center here. C'est la même forme que cela. It's the same form as this. So, you could just layer one on top of the other. Same with this, okay? So, really, you have three centers to your flower. And these are all, could be uh, stems. Ils peuvent être les tiges. So, look how fun they are. Ils sont tous attachés, mais tu peux les séparer après. So, I do think that that is quite a cool stamp set. The Tracy, parce que j'utilise souvent cette étampe et tout le monde me demande, c'est où cette étampe? Donc, le numéro 31. C'est ceux-là que j'utilise souvent dans mes échantillons. Number 46, numéro 46. C'est juste, j'aime le style, j'aime le cœur avec les fleurs. Très populaire. And then this one, numéro 50, this is for her pattern play as well. So if you go look up Tracy and see how she makes patterns with these stamps, it is incredible. Okay, so really, really beautiful. All right, we're gonna let Allison do what Allison does. And we're gonna go encourage Jay to, show, uh, to get the new stuff in so I can show it to you before the end of the video. But right now, we are going to start with just looking at the single sheets from Stamperia. Okay, donc ça c'est les feuilles à l'unité. So, Je vais vous montrer le numéro. I'm going to show you the number. 763, 763. Look at that. Just incredible. Some of these you could just frame and put in uh, a cottage or anywhere. 764, 764. So these are obviously uh, matching Amazonia. So we've got that beautiful bird. 765, 765. Et moi, je trouve les, euh, les versos sont tous euh, très abstraits. Donc, ça, c'est vraiment un verso. Et 766, 766. Aussi pour Amazonia. Donc, ça peut être les petites cartes aussi. 767. Regarde le petit paresseux. Moi, je trouve il a l'air toujours que, que il sait qu'il sourire. So, he always looks like he's smiling. 
768. Also, four beautiful. This could be a cover of a six by six album. La couverture ou la fin d'un album six par six de soit Grand Bisou, de l'Amazon, de n'importe quoi. Il est vraiment beau. Okay? Could also be the front of a card. So that's 768, 768. Now I think we're going into passion. Donc ça, c'est passion. 769. Et oublie pas qu'il ne fait pas sortir tous les papiers. Jamais, jamais. Okay, so they don't, they don't bring out all of the papers. Donc 770. 770. 771. Look at that. Just beautiful. And the pink in there is stunning. 772. 772. Then we have 773. 773. Un autre très bon pour faire des cartes. 774, 774, excuse me, 774. Now, this is Atelier des Arts. So, we've got our paint brushes, and this is the back of it. So, you can imagine how beautiful the front is. Okay? Donc, ça, c'est 773. Ça, tu peux juste encadrer, puis mets dans ton... Um, Atelier des Arts. So you could just hang this up and put it right into your craft room. You don't even have to do anything to it. 700 size. How thick is the paper? Yes, they are definitely thick enough to use in an ECD planner um, because you're going to do other things on top of it. They're a nice thickness. They're a little bit less than Minté but not terribly. Like, they're really, they're a nice, nice uh, card stock. 760 size, 776. Okay. Madame Brisson, bonjour. Bonne nouvelle. On va avoir les paillettes, finalement. On va être capable de commander les paillettes de la vigna. Mais tout le monde qui aime Lavinia, for all of you who like Lavinia, au moment, les 21 nouveaux étampes sont pas disponibles aux détaillants, mais il espère d'avoir assez de stock vers la fin de ce mois-ci. So right now, Lavinia doesn't have enough stock to open it up to um, store owners, retailers, so he says he hopes to by the end of... I guess the end of March, because he said this month. And les pinceaux sont pas disponibles pour détaillant et ni les brayers. Okay. So in case any of you have been watching all the, um, the Lavinia and you really love it, we do too. But I don't get access to it as early as you guys do. Okay. So when you see it, that's, I can get my order ready, but I can't order it until he makes it available to stores. So here's 778. 778. 779. Again, you could frame any one of these. You could do so much with them, or you can use them as frames for yourself. 780. 780. And that's with our color wheel again. Okay, Atelier des Arts. Look how pretty this is. Okay, maintenant, je vais dire cela va avec une des collections de journal. Je pense c'est le Romantic Journal. Ça, c'est un papier. 782, 782. This one obviously goes with Sea Dream. Okay, 788. Oh, it's so beautiful. We have two of them. This one goes with threads. Cela va avec la collection threads. 789. 
Et celle-ci aussi, 790, 790. Oh, did I show the back of that one? So that's the back of that one. Then we've got this one here. Look how pretty that is. Oh, very, very nice. So that's 790. 791. 791. Et 792. So all those go with threads. Okay. So beautiful um, papier individuellement. Now, Pink Fresh. Le mois passé, on a vu qu'ils ont commencé de faire plusieurs pochoirs, qu'on fait le pochoir, et après ça, on a une matrice pour le découper, ou on a une étampe pour étamper par-dessus pour mettre notre contour. OK? So last month, we saw Pink Fresh did a lot of stencils. And it was only like two weeks ago that I showed it to you. But they did a lot of stenciling that had a matching die or a matching stamp. So you could get the three together, or you could do just the die and the stamp, or just the stencils and the die. So you had lots of options. Well, they've done it again. Maintenant, ils ont sorti des étampes. Cela s'appelle Joyful Bouquet. Et tu peux le voir ici. Donc, voilà les tempes. Voilà le matrice. Joyful bouquet. Donc, on a le matrice, les tempes. And then they went and they made this. OK? Now, this is washi tape. But it's not just any old washi tape. I'm going to open it. Jay's not going to be too happy, but that's the only way you guys are going to understand this. So, right now he's very deep in thought, trying to enter the um, paper artsy for you guys. Oh, yes, I understand that, Dominic. I wish I could do that. Moi, je suis pas capable de garder juste un... <coughs> Just avec une ou deux compagnie. It is washi tape. It's washi, 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 and it's beautiful. But it's also wrapped. <laughs> Donc, je vais emprunter la couteau de Jay pour l'ouvrir. Mais maintenant, c'est plus évident que je l'ouvre. Uh, he's going to actually help me, guys. This one's not for sale Maybe it will be. I don't know, peut-être, or Diane. So what I'm going to show you guys, okay, I just want to start unrolling it. Now, first, la première chose, je vais vous dire, la première fois qu'ils ont sorti leur washi, ils ont trouvé que ça collait trop Donc, ils ne peuvent pas l'enlever de le rouleau. OK? And they were very aware of that. So, what they've done now is they've made it easier. I'm going to go put you guys there and you're going to look at me here. OK? Because I'm going to show you what it's like. OK? It's gorgeous, firstly. But just so that you can see, and I know you can't see because of the glare, but I'm going to put it on a white piece of paper so that you can see. You'd think I have paper in this shop, right? Somewhere I must have some paper. Jay, do you see a blank cardstock somewhere that I could borrow from you? Ugh. I'm going to try it on here, guys. So, I would stick this down to a cardstock, okay? And then, so you can see, that's the whole design. Look how beautiful that is. At that point, I would probably cut more than tear so that I don't rip the next design. 
or use my nail. See, I just did. I ruined the next design. Okay, so here goes. So you have this now. On ça. Maintenant, on peut prendre... J'ai mis sur un morceau de carton. Donc maintenant, c'est assez rigide pour mettre dans notre machine à découpe. Et maintenant, je peux prendre le découpe et je peux découper l'image. OK? And what's good is, you can cut it all at one time. C'est tout attaché. OK? So do we want to see that and what it looks like? Let's see. Okay, we're gonna take that and we are going to line it up. I am going to line it up first time. And of course I have to do it live, right? Nah, why would I wait? Okay, donc j'aligne tout ça. I think I'm good. I'm gonna get a little piece of washi. I'm actually gonna take the excess here. Et je vais mettre de tape pour le garder en place, okay? I know you can't see it, but you will. As Soon as I tape it, I'll show you. Je vais vous montrer. Okay. Because it can move easily, because c'est un peu glissant. So, I'm so glad you guys are all patient. Because I'm not, I want to see it cut already. Vous autres, on a plus de patience que moi. Et oubliez pas que c'est probablement la deuxième fois que j'ai jamais utilisé une machine à découpe. Non, c'est pas vrai. Okay, so here's what I've done. I have taped it, okay? Donc, j'ai mis du tape. Et maintenant, je vais à ma machine. Je vais utiliser mon Big Shot Plus. Okay, et je vais le faire ici pour vous montrer. Jay, can you hold that a moment? Hold what? The camera? Because I want to cut this. And I need another cutting plate. Okay, guys, here goes. Wish me luck. Okay, wish me luck. We're going. Okay, so it shouldn't move because I've taped it. Come on, come on. Oh, I much prefer my machine. I know everybody loves a Big Shot Plus. Me, I am a Big Shot, plain, old, simple girl. So, we're gonna go, we're gonna start the cut, and it's not going to. Because I probably have the wrong, no, I have the right shin there. Will it fit a cuddle bug? It will fit a cuddle bug, absolutely. Just keep in mind that the cuddle bug, once your plates are done, they're done. So that's unfortunate, but true. See, it won't cut. I must have the wrong shim. That's probably what Denise is screaming to the camera. You got the wrong shim. So I am gonna go to my regular cuddle bug, guys, uh, my regular big shot, because that's what I'm more accustomed to. And it doesn't want to tear. So, hey guys, this is me being me. You're all used to it. Okay, maintenant ça fit dans mon big shot et dans un cuddle bug. Okay, so here's what I'm used to. You see, it just goes. Of course, it needs two mats in order to work better. Is it still lined up? It's still lined up, as good as possible. See, this is how you stall in the video. 
You hear all that? I'm gonna roll back because I'm off the mat. So I'm afraid it didn't cut at the end. Voila, she purse. Oh no, maybe it did. Okay, and now what I have, see it didn't cut at the end. So I'm gonna show you the other pieces that did cut. Look how pretty. So it's already done. You didn't have to fussy cut it. You didn't have to color it. Il faut pas le colorer. Here you can see this one, except I'd have to run it through again parce que mon die était trop long pour mon tapis. Okay, so this one is also, it's all die cut. Donc, il fabuleux. Moi, je trouve que c'est génial comme un item. Okay, so you don't have to color. You don't have to do anything. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? So, and this one is one of my favorites. That's why I showed you this one. Okay? So, what I'm going to do is I'm not even going to put the die. Well, yeah, I have to put the die back. What question? Est-ce que die vont avec les étampes? Pour qu'une fois que le washi est discontinué, faudrait avoir les étampes. Premièrement, une rouleau de washi, il y en a beaucoup, beaucoup dedans. Donc, pour avoir à la chance de tout finir, c'est très bon. C'est si vous voulez les étampes, mais en, tu vas le trouver, on a toujours des dyes qu'on n'utilise plus après un bout de temps. Mais la montant de euh, fois que tu peux utiliser ceux-là est incroyable parce qu'il est vraiment... Euh, il y a beaucoup, beaucoup d'images sur le tape, le washi tape, le rouleau. All right, guys, I'm just going to cut the big piece because that's the one that really, really is gorgeous. So I'm just going to finish cutting it so you can see it. I'm just moving it down on my mat so that we get it all cut out. Okay. So I'm hoping I'm lining up the same in the exact same spot. Okay. So I think I just didn't line it up to the top enough. C'était ça mon problème. Okay, voila. You hear that cracking? That doesn't mean anything is breaking. It just means it's cutting. Okay, voila. Oh, of course, still had to miss one corner. There we go. So look how beautiful that bouquet is. Okay, vraiment, vraiment beau. On a la, la dorée dessus. So that's what it does, guys. I know you guys think it's as fabulous as I do. I'm going to steal the camera back from Jay. And I'm going to show you the different styles. Okay, donc celle que je t'ai montré, ça s'appelle Joyful Bouquet. All right. Yeah, I agree, Erin. A lot of customers call me and they go, my machine's doing this crackling noise. So, yes, it is terrifying, but we get over it. Donc, voilà, si tu veux les temps parce que toi, tu aimes plus colorer toi-même, donc ça, c'est aussi, c'est la même chose. Tu peux les temper puis faire ton dye en une étape, okay? And then you can do your dye in one pass. Le prochain est euh, Painted Peony Mix. Donc, ça a l'air comme ça, les tempes. Voilà le matrice. Et voilà les couleurs sur les fleurs. Je sais, c'est plus dur à voir, mais c'est difficile d'ouvrir un de chaque. But you can see those beautiful colors that are in there. Okay, so that is, I wonder if they show the wash. Ah, voila, look at that. That's what the flowers look like. Okay, ça c'est en utilisant le tape. So those are beautiful, beautiful. Le gros bouquet est en bas pour ceux-là. So these are really, really pretty. Then we have, this one's more of a wreath. It's called English, English Garden. English Garden, okay, 
English Garden. Puis, on sait que sur la matrice, il nous montre les couleurs dans les tapes. Donc, c'est ça. On a une couronne et les petits bouquets. So, we have a wreath and then we have those little bouquets. All right. So, really pretty. So, there's the die. Uh, the stamp, sorry, there is stamp and die cut, and here is the washi tape and die cut. Donc, ça a l'air comme ça sur le rouleau. That's what it looks like on the roll. Okay, our next one is called anemone. Is that what it says? Anemone. Anemone magic. Okay, I always get it wrong. An enemy. Et voilà le matrice et le matrice avec les tempes. So that's the stamp and the stamp and die. And then over here, look at the colors in this washi tape. They added in lilac and that blue. Gorgeous. I know choosing is going to be very difficult. De faire ton choix, ça va être difficile. But look how gorgeous those flowers are. Ça, c'est vraiment la morceau de ta carte. Tu le mets un peu de foam tape en dessous avec peut-être un peu de spatter or some bling. Et c'est fini. Vraiment, vraiment beau. I'm loving these. Okay? And then the last one, they really changed it up. Okay? Donc, ceux-là, ils ont vraiment changé. Sur-là, ça s'appelle Indigo Vines. Indigo Vines, c'est une couronne encore et beaucoup plus de feuillage. Et c'est ça les couleurs sur le washi tape. OK, donc c'est dans les bleus et marines. So you can see what that looks like cut out. So that's your washi tape. So a really, really interesting... Um, Interesting line, okay? I love what they did with that. So the tapes, this is the only one, Indigo Vines is the only one that doesn't have the gold on it, okay? Les autres, ils ont tout le or dessus, okay? Tout sur là. Parfait. So that is Pink Fresh. What do you guys think? Okay, and I know my demo is what sold you, of course, because these beautiful, beautiful flowers, and I'm going to leave them at the cache that you can touch them when you come in. C'est vraiment facile. Et tu l'as toutes ces images. Je vais le mettre sur une surface que tu peux le voir. Donc, on a tout ça plus deux autres que je n'ai pas fini de couper. So. Sept éléments, il me manque deux. So, seven elements, just one pass in the die cut machine. And look how beautiful that is. So, you never have to say, I can't color like that anymore, because this is beautiful. Okay? So, washi tape et le matrice. Okay, so I'm going to put that aside. I'm going to push that out of the way so I can show you all the new WOW embossing powders. Il y en a ceux qui ne sont pas nouveaux, mais resto uh, restock. Um, sorry, I keep going back and forth. So we have this one by Raquel Barillo Perez. It is called Ancient Jewels. Cela, il faut vraiment aller sur le site pour le voir. Parce qu'il est incroyable comment ça a l'air métal quand c'est des mélanges de couleurs. So here you have like a green and gold. Here you have a teal and gold. And here it's kind of a ready gold. And these, when you melt them, they are incredible. Donc, allez sur le site de WOW, embossing powder, et mettez le nom Ancient Jewels. Et tu vas voir leur échantillon. Ils sont vraiment, vraiment magnifiques. So, guys, these are a mix that really look metallic. I suggest you go on Wow Embossing Powder. Type in Ancient Jewels. And then just see the marvelous examples they have of these colors when they're heated. They are beautiful. 
then for my Tracy Scott fans, this is Tracy's new release. And of course they're all blingy. And so we have strawberry daiquiri, Mai Tai and Mojito. So that she calls Fiesta. Et Tracy est toujours avec les paillettes. Donc ça c'est des poudres pailletées, mais sont des poudres qui fondent. So these are definitely embossing powders, okay? But they're glitter embossing powders. Then we have a new one from Marion. It's called Pick Me Up. And that one has Earl Grey, which is a beautiful, it's a mixture of white and soft gray. Then we have Minty. C'est une couleur de menthe. And then we have Punch. Now, I think I did some samples with those that I showed you when I took my classes. Je pense que j'ai fait des échantillons avec eux autres. Je vais essayer de trouver tantôt. Okay, now this is a big jar, okay? This is the Metallic Gold Rich Ultra High. Ça dit quoi, Ultra High? Ça dit que les, gra les gra uh, granules sont plus gros, okay? Et que tu peux faire, c'est comme le UT, tu peux faire une couche par-dessus d'un autre, par-dessus d'un autre. Après ça, mettre un peu de Versamark sur ton étampe et étampe dans la poudre pendant que c'est encore chaud. So, this is the Ultra High Metallic Gold Rich. You can use this like UT, which is an ultra thick embossing enamel. You put this on, let's say, a piece of chipboard, and you put your first layer, you put your second layer. By the time you get to a third layer, it's nice and thick. And if you have um, a stamp already stamped with, inked up with uh, Versamark, you can stamp right into this when it's hot and it's gonna hold its form, okay? Donc vraiment beau. Et garde la valeur d'un pot comme ça. Le mini comme ça est 4,95. Le gros est comme 24. Okay, and you have more than six times the amount. You have a ton in here. Okay, now let's look at our embossing powders. So we're gonna start here. Donc voilà le metallic rich, gold rich, mais en petit format. Opaque bright white, ultra high, aussi un blanc que si on veut quelque chose plus, uh, plus épais, more chunky, I would use the uh, ultra high. Otherwise, I would use the super fine. Here we have a clear gloss powder qui est super fine. Ceux-là sont pas nouveaux, okay? It's just restock. Voilà le metallic gold rich, super fine. Donc, c'est un très, très, très... Uh, Beau or. So if you haven't tried this one, it's a beautiful gold tint. Then our rose gold. This rose gold is beautiful. It's the one I did my little sample with. Maybe we'll take a walk over there after. Uh, then we have, okay, Silly, no, Silly's Fog. This is one of the Alexandra Ranky. Don't Tu vas le voir différent non sur les bouteilles. You're going to see different names on the bottles. That's because those are the artists that chose what goes in the bottle, in the jar, okay? Also, they're anti-static jars and anti-static powders, okay? Donc, uh, mettre pas quelque chose plastique dans ceux-là et ça va rester sans statique, Okay? So this one's called Silly's Fog. You see the color? Let's see, I have more of the ranky ones. This is the opaque, opaque bright white regular. Donc moi j'adore leur noir puis leur blanc. Then this one's a ranky one. It's Judith's Blush. Et je pense que eux autres sont trans, translucides, okay? So that means you're going to be able to see through these. Son pas complètement opaque. So this one is translucent. 
this one is translucent et metallic. Okay, TM, on voit TM, translucide metallic. Translucent metallic. Here's another Rinky. This one is called Karen's Dream. Look at that color. Donc aussi translucide metallic, translucent metallic. Okay. Believe me, I wish I could emb heat emboss all of these for you. Bella's Forest. Okay, une autre translucide et metallic. Look at that color. It's almost like a teal, a rich, rich teal. C'est comme un bleu, a teal, mais très riche. Then that's, okay, this is called In the Navy. This is, everybody's been waiting for this. It is a navy blue that is stunning, okay? Cela va être très populaire, In the Navy. Then we have White Puff. Donc, ceux-là, quand on chauffe, il gonfle un petit peu. So this one, uh, when you heat it, it, uh, it expands a little bit. Halo. Ça, c'est un nouveau translucide qui a de la brillance sur ton, uh, ton projet. So this one is translucent. So it just adds this beautiful glitter on top of your project. After that, we've got white pearl. Donc, ceux-là, quand ils font, ils vont être perlé. C'est aussi un translucide. Disco ball. So this is what we were waiting for. Parce que disco ball était pas disponible en US. Il était seulement disponible en Angleterre. Donc, on a attendu pour qu'il peut l'envoyer et avoir tous les documents pour l'envoyer en US et en Canada. Okay, so Disco Ball is what held up our order is because they needed the proper paperwork and codes and everything else to get this to the United States instead of just coming from the UK. Sparkling Snow is exactly that. Donc, cela c'est opaque et ça va être la blanc qui brille. Okay, vraiment, il brille beaucoup. Then we have Rinky. What is that? Chenny's Sky. Hmm. C'est aussi translucide et métallique. Et ça a l'air comme un bleu noir. Okay? Donc, je pense pas qu'il est complètement noir. C'est l'air plus marine avec un mélange de métallique. Okay? Then we have metallic silver. Ça, c'est un ultra high aussi. Donc, ça dit que encore les granules sont plus gros. So, the grains in there are just a little bit thicker. Uh, ça, c'est le metallic silver super fine. Donc, ceux-là sont tout opaques. High heels. C'est opaque et métallique. Garde les couleurs. OK? Donc, ça, c'est les talons hauts, ça dit. Et il brille, mais iridescent. Donc, on voit dépendant la lumière. So, depending the light, how it hits it, you are going to see different colors in there. So, it's called high heels. Après ça, on a Ula's or Ula's Cognac. C'est un translucide métallique. Et ça a l'air vraiment comme une couleur de cognac mélangé avec un doré. Okay, so really, really nice. Here's another one. This one is Giddy's Power. Et cela translucide, pas metallic. Okay, just a beautiful color, but translucent. Ça, c'est le opaque bright white super fine. Voilà, on a, what is it, Christine's? Kirsten's Magic. Kirsten's Magic. Or Christina's Magic, excuse-moi. Transluc translucide métallique. Donc, c'est un bel mauve comme le aubergine. Okay? This one looks eggplant. Then, we have this one here. 
which is Manuela's honey. Donc, c'est le miel. Il est mélangé avec un métallique aussi. Et c'est vraiment une couleur miel. Then, here we've got metallic gold sparkle. Just parce que je trouve souvent, every, every lady loves a little sparkle in her life. Donc, voilà un sparkle doré. And then we have metallic silver regular. Donc, toutes les, les couleurs de base, le blanc, opaque bright white, le ebony noir, le metallic silver et le metallic gold sont les plus vendus au monde, OK? Et dans le monde. And then, so we have here black glint. C'est un noir, donc probablement un mélange avec une de leurs ebony ou quelque chose comme ça. Et il y a des paillettes. Ça a l'air comme des paillettes, mais non. Parce que ce n'est pas une métallique, mais peut-être pailleté. OK, so this is black glint. Like I said, if I could emboss them all, I would. It would be so much easier to show you. Et voilà, red glitz. Donc, juste si vous voulez Dorothy's red slippers, les souliers de Dorothy, de Wizard of Oz, uh, voilà. Ça, c'est la meilleure chose à utiliser. So, this would be your best bet. Okay? So, and then the WOW embossing pad is very popular. Versamark is fabulous. WOW stays uh, wet a little bit longer. Okay? Donc, c'est ça la plus différence entre le Versamark et le WOW. C'est juste ceux-là, ils sèchent un peu plus lentement. Donc, ça vous donne un peu plus longtemps de ajouter tes, paille, uh, tes poudres. So, both the same thing, both a watermark pad, Versamark, wow, they're interchangeable. This one just takes a little longer to dry. Now, that doesn't mean that you're going to touch it and it's going to be wet. It just means that it gives you a little bit longer to put your powders on. So, that's what that would be for, okay? So, so far, we have Pamela definitely happy because we showed the wow. I know Diane and a bunch of you are happy with that pink fresh because it is beautiful. I know the problem avec les poudres, c'est de prendre la décision laquelle à acheter. So, I know that that's going to be their, your biggest problem, c'est lequel d'acheter. Celle de Tracy, oublie pas, si t'es un maniaque de Tracy comme moi, t'es besoin de ça. Et je suggère vraiment d'aller voir les euh, ceux-là de Raquel, ok, ceux-là qui s'appellent les Ancient Jewels. It is worth going to have a look at, ok. Je te jure que tu vas aimer de le voir, ok. So you really need to do that. Now, can we talk about my friend Tracy? She hit it out of the ballpark yet again. And Lynn, Lynn did a style all her own. Okay, so let's start with my friend Tracy. Elle a montré uh, aujourd'hui sur le site de Paper Artsy People. Okay, et ça, c'est pas un site, excuse-moi, c'est un page de Facebook. Vous pouvez aller sur la page de Facebook, Paper Artsy en une mot, et People comme personne. Et ça va vous amener à la vidéo qu'elle a fait aujourd'hui montrant tous ses échantillons. Okay? So that would take you to today's video where Tracy showed a ton of samples. It also will take you to Lynn Perella who showed hers yesterday and Kay Carly who showed hers on Monday. Okay? So, voilà. Le numéro 53. I mean, look at this. Tracy gets all that little detail with just a small pen. She's incredible. Okay? This, I think, is going to be hugely popular. Donc, ça, c'est le numéro 53. And I don't think there's a name, so we'll just call it Soar. Now, this one here is magnificent. Les exemples qu'elle a montrés sur, uh, dans son journal est incroyable. Si tu ne l'as pas vu, il faut aller voir. Parce que, des fois, elle est en ça en double pour faire un diamant et elle refait, refait, refait et c'est vraiment une patron. So, 
She makes patterns with this. If you stamp it twice, your flower's full. She lines up other pieces. So she uses all of these. Ce ne pas vraiment les coins et les triangles. C'est vraiment pour faire un page au complet au motif. OK? Please, 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 allez sur la page Facebook et check ces échantillons. Tu vas capoter complètement. You are going to fall in love with pattern making. And that's just black and white, but stunning. OK? So, numéro 54. Maintenant, numéro 55. Tu sais que Tracy adore les mandalas. Donc, ça aussi, elle a fait des, des exemples exquisites avec. Et encore, tu peux mettre une par-dessus de l'autre. Tu peux mettre celle-ci par-dessus de ça. Et après ça, là, tu peux mettre ça comme la feuillage en dessous. So, they really work alone or together. Donc, ça, c'est le numéro 55. Et le numéro 56. OK, number 56. So, again, like I said, Tracy, she just does such a phenomenal job. I may be a little biased, but I absolutely adore her style. Here's a Lynn Perella one, a Lynn Perella, a Jofie one. This is a Jofie one, and I was, I, I like it, I do like it, and I just wasn't sure. And then I had two people order it, and I was like, yep, yeah, I should go with my gut. My gut said to order it. Donc, ça, c'est de Jofi, le numéro 100. OK? I know one is reserved. Somebody reserved that. Voilà le Kay Carly. OK? Elle est une autre artiste avec Paper Artsy. Elle a montré tous ses uh, projets lundi. OK? So, you can see how she used all of these. They look like little clouds that make up a flower. Very original. She really has that kind of style. OK. Après ça, on a des fleurs comme ça. Donc, elle fait beaucoup de, de je vais dire, les fleurs, la feuillage, des choses comme ça. OK. Very pretty. Uh, numéro 45. Et voilà le numéro 46. OK. Now, Julie and Dominic, do you have your paper bags ready? Julie, you have your paper bag ready? OK. Voilà ma belle Lynn Perella. Voilà le numéro 47. Ça, c'est une artiste depuis oh, des dizaines d'années. Puis, elle a un style complètement la sienne. OK. She has a style that's all her own. Even these are a little different than she's done before with the bird and the hair and everything. But it's not a far reach because it is gorgeous. Une pompe. <laughs> so voilà, Lynn Perella, numéro 47. Voilà, Lynn Perella, numéro 48. Okay. Garde le petit nid dans son cheveu. So she has a little nest as her, as her bonnet. Et les petits oiseaux, moi j'aime ça, ce petit morceau-là. Donc, vraiment, Lynn Perella, numéro 48. Le numéro 49. Celui-là, elle a montré hier sur son... Euh, euh, comme un tease avant qu'elle ait fait son, son prévu. Et tout le monde a capoté sur cette étampe-là. So, look how cool this is. Now, ça, c'est la Lynn Perella qu'on est bien habitué avec. Mais ça, c'est un changement pour elle, mais ça fit complètement dans son style. So, this is really quite cool. Number 49. And then we have number 50. So, beautiful, beautiful line. I doubt Lynn's watching, but if she was, I know she'd be happy that we just love this. Okay? So, really, really cool. And that's number 50. Dans les pochoirs, ça c'est pas nouveau, mais c'est nouveau pour eux autres. Quelqu'un m'a demandé de le commander. Et c'est le Jofi 86. OK? France Papillon. 
LFS sorti la, le mois passé ses étampes, mais à ce temps-là, euh, Paper Artsy manquait leur miler pour faire les pochoirs, donc ça est venu en retard. Donc ça, c'est le numéro 227, et tu peux le voir, elle fait beaucoup avec des cercles, et même le border, donc ça peut faire les nuages. OK et le 229. So I guess I don't have 228. Aussi de France Papillon. OK. 229. Et ça, c'est les morceaux de case tête. So that's to look like puzzle pieces. De Jofi, aussi de le mois passé, c'est le 230, mais c'est nouveau pour eux autres. OK, so we never had this. Number 230, it's just last month they were out of stencil making material and mylar, so they could not cut their stencils. So 230, 230, 231. Now this looks like it would fit so great with that stamp I showed you, stamp number 100, uh, no, 99, that had les tiges comme ça, the one that had stems that look like this. I think it's such a cool modern looking stencil. So number 231. Maintenant, de la belle Tracy. Donc on a le 233. Okay, 233. 234. Puis encore, elle a montré des échantillons avec tout ça. Okay, so she showed examples with all of this today. Number 235, and again, you'll see how she builds these into incredible items. Okay. And then number 242, 242. All right. So what do you guys think? Pretty good release, eh? And we did refill a couple of our paints. On manquait le heavy cream, on manquait le cerise, le smoke paprika. Donc, tout cela en revenu en stock. Et on a re reçu trois de les infusions. Green Man, Rusty Car et Golden Sands. Donc, ça, c'est les trois infusions qui sont arrivées ou revenues en stock aujourd'hui. So, guys, are you ready for us to put this live on the site? What are you thinking? Oh, Julie, I hope somebody's there to catch you. OK. Donc, tout le monde, en est prêt? Oh, I want to show you one last thing. You remember we showed you last week our new exclusive gnome die? Donc, c'est le matrice que j'ai montré qui est exclusive à 20 magasins, 21 magasins, je pense. Je veux vous montrer les échantillons de Ariel. OK? J'ai donné notre gnome à Ariel, puis j'ai dit, fais ce que tu, tu veux. Donc, elle a fait cette belle carte-là. Puis tu vois comme ça brille dans la fenêtre et dans son lanterne. Donc, des fois, ça a l'air vraiment comme du feu. So, this is crazy. All right. This is our exclusive gnome set. And I gave it to Ariel. She matched it up immediately with the mushroom house. And I love how she used, like, the holographic paper in there so that we can even have it look like fire. So, it's really cool. Then she did this one, again with the mushroom house. And you can see the different colors. So the gnomes are in the same colors. Um, and here is a different one. And then we have this guy. He looks more like a lumberjack gnome heading out into the forest. Dans la forêt, voilà le champignon qui vient avec le kit. On a le gazon, puis le lift the flap are arbre. Et il faut que je sors ceux-là parce qu'elle a caché des petits. On a une écureuil dedans. Et là. Oh! Je pense que ça a tombé parce que je sais que she would have put something under there. Donc voilà. How cute is he? 
So I wasn't sure about him at first, right? Like everybody, it's a gnome. We have so many gnomes. And then when I saw all the samples, quand j'ai vu les échantillons que tous les magasins ont fait, et même Ariel, j'ai tombé en amour avec cette bonhomme. J'ai vu lui utiliser comme un Père Noël. J'ai aussi vu quelqu'un qui fait le chapeau et la barbe comme un cornet de crème glacée. Donc, ils ont coloré ici. Ça, ça a l'air comme le... le euh, pas le fouetté. Uh, whipped cream. OK? So, whipped cream on top. It was really very cool. And the little mushroom is just an added bonus. So, voilà, c'est un exclusive avec Crafters Home et Lawn Fawn. Donc, disponible seulement uh, ici à, en Québec, chez nous. Mais il est disponible uh, dans environ une vingtaine de magasins seulement. So, lots and lots and lots of fun. Okay, guys, it's time to say goodbye. Tomorrow, for this just in, I don't think I'm going to have anything. I don't know. I never know. But we will see tomorrow. And if not, we will do something fun. I promise. So I will see you tomorrow. Bonsoir tout le monde. Je t'aime tous. I love you all. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you tomorrow. Now we're going to pick some orders. Bye, guys.